Hello, Northwest ISD. Uh, this is Ryder Warren, Superintendent of the School District. Um, folks, if you, don't, if you don't know me by now, this is probably my most favorite video of the school year. Um, so depending on what your own family beliefs are, Merry Christmas, uh, Happy Holidays, or just Happy Winter Break. Um, could not be more proud of our children, our staff, our families for making it through this first semester. And so what we do every year is just come on, send you this video, just telling you thank you for all the efforts, especially our students, for all the efforts that they've had this first semester. And I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna go over some thank yous uh, to some, some special folks and special groups, and then some highlight some things that we've done this first semester. First of all, let's just thank everyone for their efforts on COVID. Uh, folks, we truly were hoping and praying that COVID would not be a part of our lives this year. Uh, but it is, and you know, it is what it is. And I could not be more proud, again, of our students, our staff and our families of taking care of each other, taking care of themselves. And we've done, we've done a phenomenal job with this challenge. Uh, by working together, we've overcome this COVID challenge this year. The cases across the district are continuing to lower. So uh, we will probably hear about more variants as we move uh, further. So we'll, let's just make sure that we continue to uh, take care of ourselves um, and, uh, and we're gonna get through this together. Just some information for everyone, our enrollment continues to increase. Uh, we're getting new families into the district every day and we wanna say a very special welcome to those families. We are almost at 28,000 students now. You know, we, we have 31 campuses across the, the district and um, 28,000 kids are in those campuses every day. And we just wanna make sure that our new families uh, feel a very warm welcome, this, especially this time of year. I wanna say a special thank you to all those who supported our NEF resource store. Uh, NEF opened a free resource store and library to support teachers and students. And we could not be more proud of our NEF board and all those folks who supported that. And folks, this just talks about the specialness of Northwest ISD. Cannot say enough about everybody who supported Angel Tree. Angel Tree is this year helping more than 1,200, 1,200 students thanks to this community support. So those are students who will experience Christmas and probably would not have had we not had this. So all those folks who are working through the school district and the Angel Tree program, Thank you so much. The staff who is doing it, our volunteers who are doing it, you're making a difference to kids. Okay, let's talk about some congratulations. We've had a wonderfully successful first semester. And again, cannot be more proud of the kids and the staff who've been involved in this. Uh, first of all, just a shout out to Berkshire Elementary School. This is its first year in operation. Our parents, our families, our students, our staff at Berkshire are doing an amazing job in the new building. Another shout out to our Aquatic Center staff, all of our students. Folks, the Aquatic Center has turned into a facility that is almost open 24 seven. Uh, seven days a week, we have kids, we have students who are going through, uh, our elementary students are going through that daily for swim lessons. We have people in our community who are going that for rehab services. And then our teams, our clubs are in it every day. So that has become an amazing success and we appreciate everybody who supported the Aquatic Center. Fantastic job to Byron Nelson Symphony Orchestra. Uh, the, these kids received an invitation to perform at the prestigious Midwest Clinic, an international band and orchestra convention held in December, uh, which only features 50 musical groups across the nation. So Byron Nelson Symphony Orchestra, fantastic job. Also congratulations to Byron Nelson, Eaton, and Northwest football teams. All three of our football teams made the state playoffs this year. Byron Nelson advanced all the way to the third round of the playoffs. Could not be more proud of our young men and our coaches and all, everybody who supported our football teams. On our girls' side, Eaton and Northwest volleyball teams also advanced to the state playoffs, and Eaton advanced all the way to the regional finals. Phenomenal job by our young ladies and our coaches with that. One more thing athletically, uh, VR Eaton girls cross country advanced to the state playoff in uh, cross country, the state uh, cross country meet for the first time in school's history. So for our cross country girls at Eaton, fantastic job young ladies. And also in cross country, Byron Nelson boys and girls also advanced. So we're very proud of those kids. 
Academically, uh, we have some kids who are just knocking the top off of uh, everything that they do in our classrooms. This year, we've had 18 commended scholars for the National Merit Scholarship Program. That is phenomenal. That ranks our students against every other student in the nation, and these 18 are phenomenal. Congratulations to Samuel Beck Elementary School. Uh, it was named U.S. Best Elementary School in the nation. It was on that list, and we cannot be more proud of the crew at Beck. Hughes Elementary School and Granger Elementary School received the TEPSA Student Leadership Award. And then as a school district, uh, Northwest ISD was awarded the Texas Comptroller's Transparency Stars Award for our budgeting processes. Congratulations also to Clara Love Elementary School. It has been selected for a $5,000 impact award from A4LE to create an outdoor learning space. Great job, Love. Another one of our programs, our Family Involvement Program, was awarded two awards this semester. We had the Parent Educator of the Year and the Family Involvement Program won the prize for innovation. Great job to that crew for everything that they do for our children and for our, for our families. Congratulations to our Byron Nelson Culinary Academy. Our Northwest ISD Bistro is the first school in the state of Texas to earn the American Culinary Federation accreditation. So all of our crew at the Bistro, congratulations. With this video and this time of year, we always have a Christmas card, holiday card contest. So I wanna show you the winner of that contest this year. Today we're at Midland Middle School and we have our eighth grader here. And her name is Lakshia Mayapin. She's an eighth grader at Midland and her mother's here, Suganya, and her awesome art teacher here, Dustin Marvin, is here with us to do that. But uh, Luxia, you've won this year. And, and that's, that's all six middle schools. And we had hundreds and hundreds of kids who submitted these pictures and who did a wonderful job. But you were voted on to be the winner for the whole Northwest ISD. And, and you gotta understand, this is going to be our Christmas card that goes to thousands of people and your name is gonna be on it and we're just very, very proud of you. So we hope we hope y'all have a great holiday break and we're just, and understand, we're just very, very proud of you for doing this. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. You. So folks, uh, as you can see, we, we've had a phenomenal first semester of school. Uh, we, we started this semester, I, I can say it, a little fearful. Uh, COVID was still in our lives. We didn't know what it was gonna look like. We, um, I think we committed to each other that we were going to have the best sem uh, semester, the best school year that we've had, and folks, we're doing it right now. So again, I could not be more proud of our students, our staff, and our families. Uh, and, and just folks, it's time to have that, this, uh, this uh, winter break. It's time for us to be with our families and on behalf of the Northwest ISD Board of Trustees and all the faculty and staff at Northwest ISD, again, depending on what your family's belief are, have a wonderful, wonderful Merry Christmas. Have a great Christmas holiday, a holiday season, or just a semester winter break. Um, we really, truly appreciate you. And again, the blessings that we have in our life truly are our children and we cannot say thank you enough to our parents for allowing us to be a part of your children's lives. So uh, let, let's have a great break and then let's commit ourselves to having a phenomenal second semester of this school year. Thank you and everyone be safe.